I'm going to be Google translating Minecraft mobs 3,000 times and then making whatever result I get. The first mob is the warden. Translate. And we got big smile. For this one, I think I'm going to make huggy wuggy. First, let's change his body shape. And we'll also make the legs longer. And we'll do the same for his arms. Now let's shape his head into a triangle. And we'll color him fully blue. Next, let's give him a big red smile. And we'll color the back of his mouth black. Now let's add some teeth. And we'll give him some big scary eyes. Now let's add his blue bow. And we'll give him some yellow feet. Now let's give him some hands as well and finally we'll spike up the top of his head a bit i think that looks pretty good let's see him in game that doesn't look too bad there's a slight issue when he walks though honestly it kind of makes him scarier why are they all nodding their heads let's see one crawl out of the ground oh god that is way too cursed let's spawn a bunch of huggies their walk is so messed up huggy wuggies versus the wither oh they're already getting angry get him huggies that literally did no damage yo they just launched him oh my god the huggy wuggies look so weird when they sonic boom come on wither you can do this Oh my god, the wither is getting destroyed. That was fast. Huggy Wuggy is a lot more powerful than I thought. Alright, I give Huggy Wuggy an 8 out of 10. He looked good, but he's broken. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a husk. Translating. And we got Captain. For this one, I'm going to make Captain America. Let's color his body fully blue, and we'll give him some red gloves and shoes. Now let's add the star on his chest, and we'll draw his belt, and let's add the red and white part on top. Now we'll color in his face, and let's draw his mask. Now we'll give him some eyes, and a mouth, and let's give him a little nose. Now we'll add the A on his head, and let's give him his shield, let's just draw the star in the middle, and we'll extend his shoes out a bit. Okay, I think he looks pretty good, let's see him in game. Okay, that doesn't look too bad. Let's spawn a baby Captain America. He doesn't look too strong. Let's see if Captain America can save this villager. No, you're supposed to fight him, not join him. Well, he kind of saved him, I guess. Okay, you can stop chasing him now. Okay, I've had enough of this. Really? This guy won't even do anything? Well, I'm sorry, villager. Good job, Captain America. Let's spawn a Captain America army, and let's see if they can defeat the Iron Golem. Wow, the Iron Golem is actually killing a lot of them. And they won. That was a lot closer than I thought it would be, though. Alright, I give Captain America an 8 out of 10. And I think he turned out okay. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a piglin. What will we get? And we got scary bear. For this one, I think I'm going to make Freddy Fazbear. Let's delete these things, and we'll color him fully brown. Now let's extend his mouth out a bit, and we'll color the top part a lighter shade of brown. Now let's color the inside of his mouth, and we'll draw his eyes. Now let's give him some eyebrows, and we'll add his black nose. Next, let's give him some teeth, and we'll add his top hat. Now let's give him some ears, and we'll add his belly patch. Next, let's give him a bow tie, and we'll make his arms and legs animatronic like Now let's give him his microphone, and finally we will add his feet. Alright, I think that looks pretty good, let's see it in game. Okay, that looks good. We definitely have to go to the nether though. Okay, he's not shaking anymore. And this one has boots, although they don't really fit. What happened to his teeth? Why are some of them smaller? Let's spawn a baby Freddy. Yo, he's so tiny. Look at how fast he's running. Honestly, baby Freddy isn't even scary. Let's spawn a Freddy army. I think you should take the helmet off. It doesn't really seem to fit. Let's get chased by all the Freddies. Oh god, they all have their crossbows ready. I don't think they'll be able to get me here. Wait, how did this guy get across? Wait, I didn't mean to kill him. Oh god, they're all getting across. I definitely didn't almost die. Alright, I give Freddy a 10 out of 10. I think he turned out really good. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is an evoker. Translate and we got poison. For this one, I think I'm going to make venom because venom is kind of like poison. Let's color his body black and we'll color his head as well. Now let's shape his head so his mouth is open and we'll give him some eyes. Now let's color his mouth in red. Next, let's give him some teeth and we'll extend out his big tongue. I think that looks good. Now let's draw the spider on his chest and I think that looks good. Let's see him in game. Okay, that looks pretty good. His tongue looks kind of weird though. I'm not going to lie. Let's see venom fight a villager. Oh wait, it's a swamp villager. Oh yeah, venom won't even fight him. The vexes just do it. Let's see if Venom will drop a totem. I don't know why I did that. I already knew he would drop one. Let's spawn a bunch of Venoms. Oh, these ones have a flag. Venom army versus a villager. Oh my god, that was crazy. Look at how many Vexes they just spawned. I need to see that again. Wait, he lived? Never mind. Oh no, the Vexes are dying. Venom versus Captain America. Who will win? Alright, they don't fight. I'm gonna give Venom a 9 out of 10. He looks pretty good. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is an Iron Golem. Translating. And we got Wrestler. For this one, I think I'm going to make the rock. Specifically from this picture. Let's extend this out a bit, and we'll color his shirt in black. Now let's give him some blue jeans, and we'll add his fanny pack. Now let's draw the belt around his body, and we'll give him a gold chain. Now let's color in his head, and we'll also color in his hands. Now let's draw his face, and I'm going to try to make him do the thing from this picture. Let's give him some eyebrows, and we'll draw some eyes underneath. Now let's draw his mouth, and finally we'll give him a nose. Okay, that looks a little weird. Let's see him in game. Alright, that looks okay. Okay, I really should not have tried to make his face look like that. But other than the face, I think he looks pretty 
pretty good. The Rock versus Venom, who will win? Okay, Venom literally stood no chance. Come on, you can do it. Let's spawn an army of Dwayne's. Okay, that actually could have been really bad. The Rock army versus Venom army. Oh my god, Venom got destroyed. Rock army versus Captain America army. Okay, these guys literally stand no chance. The Rock is too powerful. What about the Rock army versus Huggy Wuggy army? Okay, they killed one. This fight might actually be close. Come on, Huggy Wuggy, you can defeat The Rock. One more left. And they actually did it. I guess The Rock isn't that powerful. Alright, I give The Rock an 8 out of 10. His face looked a little weird. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a zombie. What will we get? And we got Dark. For this one, I'm going to make Darth Vader. Let's color him fully black, and we'll add his helmet. Now let's give him some red eyes, and we'll color parts of his face gray. Now let's add the thing on his chest, and we'll give him a black cape. Let's also color his helmet darker black, and we'll color his hands gray, and we'll do the same for his feet. Now let's give him a red lightsaber and i think that turned out good let's see him in game okay that actually looks really good his legs are going through his cape though but other than that he looks good let's spawn a baby darth vader i honestly think the baby looks better let's spawn a bunch of darth vaders and let's see if they can defeat the rock the rock is going crazy the rock might actually win never mind he killed a lot of them though look at this guy just standing up here avoiding the fight now let's see if the vader army can defeat huggy wuggy or maybe they just won't fight him oh never mind he seems angry oh god he just destroyed that guy Okay, these guys don't even seem to care. This fight is boring. Alright, I give Darth Vader a 10 out of 10. I think he looks really good. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a pillager. Translate. And we got Cowboy. For this one, I think I'm going to make Woody. Let's color his pants blue. And we'll color his shirt yellow. Now let's color in his face and his hands. And we'll give him some hair. Now let's add his eyebrows. And we'll draw his eyes underneath. Next, let's add his mouth. And we'll extend out his nose. Now let's give him his cowboy hat. And we'll add his cow spot jacket. Now let's add the star on his chest. And we'll give him a belt. Now finally we'll add his boots, and that looks kinda weird, let's see him in game. Yeah, his face still looks pretty weird, but honestly that's just how he looks anyway. Let's see if baby Woody looks any better. Oh, there are no baby pillagers. In that case, let's spawn more Woodies. Why are they all aiming their bows at me? I'm kinda scared. Woody versus one villager, who will win? Oh god, they're all shooting each other, and now half of them fell in a cave. How did one of the Woodies manage to die? Another one died, oh my god. Finally, that was embarrassing. Alright, let's give them a real challenge. So many of them are dying from their bows. Okay, they actually killed him. They're not as bad as I thought. Alright, I give Woody a 7 out of 10. His face looks really weird. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a piglin brute. Translating. And we got strong. For this one, I'm going to make Mr. Incredible. Let's color his body red. And we'll color his hands black. And we'll do the same for his shoes. Now let's add his underwear. And we'll put the orange stripe above it. Now let's add the Incredibles logo on his chest. And we'll color in his head. Now let's give him some hair. And we'll draw his mask. And we'll add his eyes. Now let's give him a smile. And we'll make him a little bit bit more buff. Okay, that looks more like his son than him, but let's see it in game. Yeah, that doesn't really look like Mr. Incredible, but if I was making his son, then I'd say I did a good job. Oh yeah, we have to go to the nether. Now that's much better. Let's go to the bastion and try to find Mr. Incredible. There he is. Along with Freddy wearing a helmet that covers his eyes. Let's see if he will fight Dwayne Johnson. Oh, he actually did a lot of damage. Let's spawn a bunch of Mr. Incredibles. And let's see if I can survive this time. Oh god, I'm still on one heart. Oh, they all stopped chasing me. Let's see if I can win a 1v1 against Mr. Incredible. Okay, he does a lot of damage. Wait, why are more of them attacking me? Oh god, that's not good. Alright, I give Mr. Incredible a 5 out of 10 because he doesn't really look like Mr. Incredible. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a giant. What will we get? And we got green mustache. For this one, I think I'm going to make Luigi. Let's color in his blue overalls, and we'll add the green to his shirt. Now let's add his yellow buttons, and we'll color in his white gloves. Next, let's color in his head, and we'll give him some eyes. Now let's add his mustache, and we'll extend his nose out a bit. Now let's add his green hat, and we'll put some hair on the sides. Now let's give him some ears, and we'll add the L on his hat. Now let's finally extend his shoes out a bit, and that looks pretty good. Let's see him in game. Okay, he looks pretty good. I don't know why I keep remaking the giant though. He literally does nothing. Literally all he can do is stand here and take damage. I wonder if the rock will attack him. Yeah, I guess he doesn't like giants. Oh no, the rock is sinking. And so is Luigi. Wait, who will die first? Okay, it's looking like Luigi wins this one. Can Iron Golems even drown? Okay, I'll just leave you down here, I guess. I give Luigi a 7 out of 10. He's kind of boring. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a Guardian. Translate. And we got Monster. For this one, I'm going to make Mike Wazowski. Let's delete all this, and we'll give him some legs. Now let's color him fully green, and we'll draw his big eye. Let's color his eye green, and we'll give him a big mouth. Now let's add some teeth, and we'll add his arms, and let's copy that over. Alright, I think that looks good. Let's see him in game. Okay, he looks really weird. He also cannot stop jumping. It's 
seems. That's better. Okay, now he's really fast. I'm really not sure if this is what Mike Wazowski is supposed to be like. I prefer him jumping on land better. Let's spawn an army of Mike Wazowskis. Look at them all bouncing around. Imagine if this was a real mob. I wonder if he'll chase me in survival. Okay, I should not have done that. Mike Wazowski versus Darth Vader. Okay, they don't fight, I guess. I wish I made the Elder Guardian a big Mike. Alright, I give Mike Wazowski a 9 out of 10 because he was funny. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a Wither Skeleton. Translating. And we got Freeze. For this one, I think I'm going to make Frozone. Let's color his body blue. And we'll give him white gloves. Now let's add the pattern on his chest. And we'll change the shape of his head. Next, let's color in his head. And we'll extend his goggles out a bit. And let's add the blue stripe. Now let's give him a mouth. And we'll add his facial hair above it. Now let's give him a nose. And finally, we'll color in his boots. Okay, that doesn't look too bad. Let's see him in game. Alright, that doesn't look too bad. I just realized I put Frozone in the desert though, which is kind of the opposite of where he should go. Let's go find him in the nether, because that makes even more sense. And here are some Frozones in their not-so-natural habitat. Let's spawn some Mr. Incredibles to go with these guys. Okay, that's not supposed to happen. I thought they were friends. Alright, let's spawn a bunch more Frozones. And let's see if this many Frozones can defeat the rock. It's not looking good for the rock right now. Dang, the Frozones won. Now let's see if I can survive the Frozones. Oh god, I'm very slow on the soul sand. No, why is the skeleton helping them? I don't think they can get me up here. Never mind, I was wrong, they found me. Alright, I give Frozone an 8 out of 10. He doesn't look too bad. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a zombie piglin. What will we get? And we got Trainer. For this one, I'm going to make Ash catch him. Let's color his pants blue, and we'll color his shirt black. Now let's give him white sleeves, and we'll color his hands in his head. Now let's add his blue jacket, and we'll add his blue and green gloves to his hands. Now let's give him some eyes, and we'll add his mouth. Now let's extend his hair out on the side, and we'll give him his hat, and let's add the green symbol on the front. Alright, that looks decent. Let's see him in game. Yeah, that looks kind of weird. He kind of looks like an old man with that hair. It seems I also forgot to extend his jacket to his back. Let's watch Freddy Fazbear turn into Ash. Wait, why is he running? Okay, that was perfectly normal. Let's spawn a baby Ash. Baby Ash looks so much worse. Let's spawn an army of Ashes, and I have to try this. Oh god, the babies are so fast. Wait, Ash, this is a mistake. I'm not a Pokemon. Alright, I give Ash a 7 out of 10. A lot of things went wrong. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a Wither. Translate, and we got Evil Clown. For this one, I think I'm gonna make the Joker, but as a Wither. Let's color the bottom of his body purple, and we'll color his heads white. Now let's add a smile to the first head, and we'll also add his eyes. Now let's do the same on the two other heads, and we'll add green hair to the middle head and we'll extend it out on the sides a little bit, and we'll also add a little part on his forehead. Now let's copy the hair to the other two heads, and I think we're done, let's see it in game. Okay, I really don't know what to say about this one. The middle head looks like the Joker, but the other ones, not so much. Joker, chill, what did the chickens do? Okay, I'm not gonna lie, this is probably one of the most cursed mobs I've made. Let's see if the Joker can defeat Captain America. Never mind, they don't fight, I guess. What about the Joker versus Dwayne Johnson? Okay, I think the Joker is stuck. Let's help him out of here. Okay, this isn't even fair. The Rock literally didn't stand a chance. What about the Joker versus Huggy Wuggy? Huggy Wuggy is kind of getting destroyed. I won't lie, I think the Joker is going to win this one. This fight has been going forever. Wow, I guess the Joker is the new most powerful mob. And he even left a rose for us. Alright, I give the Joker a 6 out of 10. He was kind of weird. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is an LA. Translating, and we got Little Monkey. For this one, I'm going to make Diddy Kong. Let's get rid of his wings, and we'll add a few legs. Now let's color his body brown, and we'll extend his mouth out a bit. Now let's give him some eyes, and we'll add his red hat. Now let's give him some ears, and I'll draw his little red shirt. Now let's color his hands and belly, and we'll give him a little brown tail. And I think that looks pretty good, let's see it in game. Okay, there's definitely something wrong here. At least when he stands, he looks fine. Well, kind of. Yeah, that is definitely a problem. Let's see if he can collect these diamonds for me. Well, at least he can do that. Okay, that made his arms look even worse. Let's spawn an army of Diddy Kongs. This noise is so weird. Let's tame as many of these Diddy Kongs as possible. And now I have my own army of Diddy Kongs following me. Let's watch them all fight over this one diamond. That was kind of cool. It was like a Diddy Kong race. Now I'll throw a bunch of diamonds. And I'll fly away so they can't bring them back to me. Wait, these guys are actually kind of fast. Oh, it looks like they found more. Alright, I give Diddy Kong a 5 out of 10. He was just too broken. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a creeper. What will we get? And we got Purple Scare. For this one, I think I'm going to make Gengar. Let's delete his body and back legs, and we'll move his head down. Now let's color him light purple, and we'll add some tiny arms on the side. Now let's add the spiky parts on his head, and we'll give him some red eyes. Now let's draw his mouth, and we'll give him some angry eyebrows. And finally, let's give him some pupils. And I think that looks good. Let's see it in game. Okay, I don't know if that looks good or bad. I have no idea why his face is off center. 
Oh god, why does his head move like that when he's walking? Let's see if Ash can catch Gengar. Okay, I don't think he's interested. Let's see if I can catch Gengar. Nope, it's still not working. Let's spawn an army of Gengars. Okay, now Ash is interested in the Gengars. Let's see a supercharged Gengar. Oh god, they're all on fire. I don't know why I keep doing this. It never works. Let's see if Gengar can kill Ash. Yeah, I don't think that's what happens in the show. Alright, I give Gengar a 6 out of 10. I don't know why his face isn't centered. It's time for the next mob. The next mob is a wolf. Translate. And we got mystery. For this one, I think I'm going to make Scooby-Doo. Let's remove this part, and we'll extend his body out a bit. Now let's color him fully brown, and we'll add his blue collar. Now let's draw his black nose, and we'll give him a few black spots on his body. Now let's change the shape of his ears, and we'll color the middle pink. Now let's add some eyes, and we'll rotate his tail so that it's pointing upwards. And I think that looks good. Let's see him in game. Okay, what happened to his tail? This is the first time I've seen a mob's body part completely disappear. Wait, never mind. I found it. We're just gonna act like that didn't happen. To be honest, this guy is way too small to be Scooby-Doo anyway. And let's make him even smaller by spawning a baby. Yeah, that's probably the right size. Okay, why is his head floating? I'm just gonna ignore that too. Scooby-Doo is cursed. Let's tame a Scooby. I don't have any Scooby snacks, so hopefully a bone will work. Okay, now his collar doesn't fit as well. Go kill Captain America, Scooby-Doo. Okay, Scooby actually almost died. Hopefully this will repair him. Let's hop in the mystery machine, Scooby. Okay, this isn't the mystery machine, but it's the best I could get. Look at his tail just floating over there. Alright, I give Scooby a 4 out of 10. He was just too broken. And that's the last mob. Please subscribe. I don't have an outro.